G'day guys, MF West here, and different type of video today. I'm um, just focusing on what was said in the last discussion between Ian and John Allen, I think it was. Basically, uh, developers behind um, World of Warcraft. They do these little, like, interviews where they discuss what's happening in the, in the foreseeable future for BFA, whatever expansion it is, all the upcoming patch. And the discussion was BFA for this one, and a lot of things were said, and nothing too substantial because it's a long way until the expansion actually comes out but one thing that everyone's talking about and that I want to give my opinion to you guys is personal loot and the re possible removal of master loot so right now as it stands as you guys can see in this little bit of writing here um, personal loot is the desired loot rule moving forward uh, some people have kept using master loot to funnel set pieces to specific people but set pieces are gone in better battle for Azeroth, so personal loot is only a good thing. It will help to balance things at the top of the end raid of the end raid scene and split runs. So, guys, before I get into this, um, yeah, this video is going to be about discussing why why Blizzard are looking to remove personal loot and just my opinion on why I think master loot is the better option. So, let's get straight into it, guys. Alrighty, guys, thought I'd show some PvP footage in the background while I discuss uh, master loot and personal loot. So, master loot. People call it ninja loot, but it's been around since the beginning of WoW almost, and why are they removing it? Why? I think it's a great way of splitting up loot in your raid, um, especially in a guild environment. I can understand Master Loot not being amazing in pugs, which is why they introduced the whole option of you have to be in a guild for uh, just for WOD and Legion, but I just, it's not a good idea. Um, Right now, most uh, raiding guilds, well, most of the high-end raiding guilds as well, are using um, RC Loot Council. So basically, a, a set group of people decide who gets the loot, um, depending on performance and require. Basically, the the requirements for the next fight, they give loot to who they think should be, you know, given the loot. Obviously, you're gonna have people that um, basically perform better than other people. Rightfully, they deserve loot. Without master loot. Literally, loot's going to come down to RNG, and that is not good. You're not going to be able to look for certain pieces. Um, I can understand where they're kind of going with this. Um, people are going to want to be spamming more raids so they have a higher chance of getting the item they want. But I don't know about you guys, but my luck on personal loot is so, so bad. I've never like gone into a personal loot run and just gotten the item that I want. It never happens. And now that we're not going to have artifact weapons... We're going to need weapons with no master looting for weapons. That's just going to be so weird. Like, people are going to be getting weapons randomly, trinkets randomly. And I just, I really do hope they re. If they're going to remove master loot, I'd rather them rethink it and rearrange, change master loot how it works. But, like, you no, know, please not personal loot for a raid environment. So, the main reason why they're removing it, why they're removing it, they mentioned it in the MMO post is because of split runs. As you guys saw in the race for uh, basically every race in Legion for completion of each raid tier, split runs were a huge thing. Guilds, top, top, top end guilds were using like three different runs to get loot on three different characters, set of characters. And I can understand them not liking this, but um, Asmund Gold recently said this as well in a video, if, they, if those guilds want to put like 12 hours into a day, and put that much effort into those runs, by all means, Blizzard, let them freaking do it. Holy shit, like, you can't, you can't change an entire rule based on a high, I know that part, everyone looks to those guilds uh, for the high-end progression, and basically they, we look at their, how they do it in the race to see if we, if, you know, us normies are going to be able to do a good job in our mythic content, but that is ridiculous, like, I really do hope they rethink this whole Master Loot thing, but guys, give me your opinion, what do you guys think, should they get rid of Master Loot, or do we really need to take personal loot, a lot of you will probably like personal loot, a lot of people that pug actually would enjoy personal loot, but, um, yeah, just not a fan, guys. Been, um, I've been a big fan of Master Loot since the beginning. That being said, I haven't had anything like really badly <laughs> ninja off me, so I, I can understand why some people would hate it. But man, that's I would even be cool with like rolling for loot, but that's that's also pretty irritating sometimes. But hey, at least like you know you can get certain pieces of gear that you want, but. 
Anyway, guys, that's going to be the video. It was a quick, short video giving my opinion on the topic, and hopefully this won't go through. I have opted into the BFA Alpha, so you never know. Blizzard might pick me to give me a key, and then I can show you guys some content. But until then, guys, more videos to come, and you can watch me stream at twitch.tv slash mfwest. I basically made my um, Twitch schedule, and I have a video um, coming out discussing that. So have a good one, guys. Stay holy. Peace.